My name is JB Supes. I'm a senior teaching fellow in the mechanical, biomedical and design engineering department here at Aston University. We employ the CDIO or Conceive, Design, Implement, Operate educational framework. CDIO is an approach to engineering education that goes beyond just the design of the product to also cover its manufacture and its testing. In the case of our first year students, for instance, by the time they finish their first year of studies here at Aston, they will have all manufactured and raced an electric car, as well as made a wind turbine. CDIO is really valuable for students because it promotes skills that go beyond just the design, skills that are very appreciated by industry, but that also allow them to develop a practical approach to the design of engineering solutions. Thanks to the CDIO framework, what we found is that the students are really able to find employment afterwards and put forward skills that are unique and reflect on actual real life products that have designed, manufactured and tested throughout their studies here at Aston. This year the CDIO Academy took place in Trondheim. It was an opportunity for engineering students to work together on real life projects. A big part of CDIO is working in teams and also managing time which Aston really pushed us to do. Norway is known for never getting dark, so it was amazing seeing that it was still light outside at 2am. The people were also incredibly kind and helped out if we ever needed assistance. After taking a tour around NTNU University, we began working on our projects in the Groover building. I was responsible for designing, so I spent my week working on the CAD model of the ship. My group focused on issues with charging electric charged vehicles, one of them being electric powered vehicles that don't run that long. In order to fix this, we designed small ships carrying batteries that would wirelessly charge large ships on the go. The most memorable part of my trip was showcasing our work to the judges. It was really fulfilling to see what we had created and the solutions to the problem. We also received certificates at the end, which was really good. 